This next cut now is, is from Switzerland, from Zurich, from some years back. Geller is much younger at this point, and this particular segment shows him bending a ladle. Uh, now, when you see this, you're not going to solve much unless your eyes are really keen, and with this tape machine, I don't think we'll be able to, to see, or this projection system, I don't think we'll be able to see one of the things that is on here, but we'll give it a try. As soon as it's over, I'll explain to you another pertinent fact about it that you would have no way of knowing by watching the program. Let's see it. As somebody has a, a more personal thing, it works much better than just mm -hmm. things, you know. Uri sagt, dass in der Regel the persönliche Gegenstände, also Oh, good. Well, I'll try this. This looks nice. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Take a cue from him. Also, er sagt, you dass persönliche right. äh, Gegenstände in der Regel äh, sich eher verbiegen als ganz unpersönliche, wie eben zum Beispiel ein solcher Nagel. Äh, is she known here in the... Tele in the ja. ja. Wäre es möglich, Uri, dass sich der Löffel nachher verbiegt? Do you feel something? Yes, that's a very good shot. Mm -hmm. Tell the cameraman. Er sagt, dass es eine sehr gute Aufnahme sei mit der Kamera. And I'm saying bend, bend in my head all the time. Der denkt, biege, biege, biege. Yes? No, no, but go on into it. And there is no way to bend it just by stroking it like this with force. It's very gentle. Mm -hmm. Also er möchte nochmals betonen, dass er also keine Kraft anwendet, sondern dass er die Biegung, die Veränderung nur durch Berührung äh, erreichen will. Hold it, little, hold it. And I feel, I feel for this so good, I feel something, but... Könnte es ein Material sein, das nicht, das sich nicht eignet? What is it? Could it be a kind of material? No, every metal <coughs> bends, uh, it doesn't matter what it is made out of. Er sagt also, alles Metall kann er biegen, das spielt keine Rolle. Is it possible that it breaks? One minute, I it think it's, I think it's bend. moving already a little. Yes, yes, it breaks, yes, it yes, it's moving. Breaks. Yes, it's it's moving. It's moving. Oh, come on. Who's It's you see I feel here you see it's becoming more plastic yes yes er sagt dass es es look it fühlt sich jetzt fast an wie plastik and there is no heat you feel it really 
Spüren Sie, dass es heiß wird? Zum nein, 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 aber kein ich habe das Gefühl, es verbrennt. Put your finger nicht. also here, please, and you'll see that there is actually no heat. Nein, aber hier ist Hold it like this. Hold it like this. Tell me if you feel something. Well, kalt, keep holding kalt, it. Ja. Keep holding it. Ah, da unten ist es gerissen. What is it? Hold it like this. Tell me if you feel anything. Not with power, with lightly. Ja. Yes, press, no pressure. I'm sorry it takes so long, but yeah, it's... It works. Very gentle. Yeah, 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 the whole thing is yeah, moving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. But it's not... It's no, no, it's break. It's getting also, a wenn er jetzt ein bisschen Do Kraft an, anwenden würde, würde es brechen. Aber er berührt es nur, ich spüre, dass es gar keine Kraft dabei. Do you feel that it's, it's becoming more... Look, it's becoming like a plastic. Yeah. Oh. There. <laughs> There. And no heat, touch it. There is no nah. heat. And look how thick it is. Now it broke right at the rivet spot there, you'll notice. The question was, did he supply these uh, spoons? No, they were supplied by a physicist who showed up there to be an expert observer of this. And indeed, he was a little more expert than Geller gave him credit for, because I interviewed him after that, some years after that, and he said they would not allow me to say on the program that though I supplied all the spoons and such, I didn't supply that one particular aluminum ladle. That came from nowhere. I asked the prop man afterwards. He said he didn't know where it came from. And that was the one, remember, that Geller chose out of all of the cutlery they had there. And they had about 30, well, you didn't see them, but there are 30 pieces of cutlery all over the table. That was the one he chose. And if you look, and we have made stills from this tape, which is rather high resolution in the original. This is a copy of it, of course. Um, we, you actually see, when he first present, you can see a crack right at that rivet spot. You know very well that's the spot where it's going to break. <laughs>